Good morning, everybody. I would like to, to show you the background of the project. What is it about? Um, first, I would like to introduce myself. As Kristiana said, um, my name is Michal Masaryk. I'm from Slovakia. Uh, I'm a member of the Association of Parents and Friends of Deafblind Children in Slovakia. And that's why, because I'm deafblind, uh, no, because I'm a sibling to my deafblind brother, as Christiana mentioned already. And, ah, okay. So, because of development in the European Union, as there are more members, new legislation, and new agreements, people affected by deafblindness and people working in the field realize the great differences in services provided to people with deafblindness across member states. There was an opportunity to make more people understand deafblindness and to change things for the better. That's why this project, that's why this project. People with deafblindness, their families, organizations and professionals from the European Union member states began collaborating and together we identified some of indicators of life quality. We call them the indicators of deafblindness equality in Europe or IDBEE and they are based on indicators of disability equality in Europe or IDEE. We chose some of the most important indicators and we made a questionnaire which we sent to 29 organizations across member states. We also made a survey to ask people with deaf blindness and their families what they thought of it and whether we were getting it right for them. The outcome of this project is the report that we are presenting you today. Is it somewhere? The book? This one. <laughs> My friends will tell you throughout next hours more about the project in more details, how it was, how we proceeded, and what are the results and the conclusions that we have drawn. We would like to ask you to make a difference, to make a difference in the lives of people with deafblindness across Europe. We would like to ask you to make a noise. And that's all, thank you for your attention. <laughs> <laughs>